<laughs> hey guys, how's it going? Michael Troy here, and today we're looking at Flash from 1987, number one, by Mike Barron, Jackson Guice, and Larry Malstead. All right, so this is post-Crisis on Infinite Earths, uh, after Barry Allen bit the dust, which was, you know, big news of the day. And this is uh, when DC was kind of rebooting the universe and reintroducing characters. And this is Wally West taking over the mantle of The Flash, written by Mike Barron, who was like one of the premier writers of the 80s. Like he wrote everything like Punisher, Punisher War Journal, um, you know, uh, gosh, uh, Nexus, um, just so many things. And um, very, he relaunched uh, Flash here, and it's illustrated by Jackson Guice, um, who's also known as Butch Guice, who's like been consistently working in comics forever. Um, he's been associated with Superman and the X Men and uh, freaking uh, Micronauts and just all kinds of things. He's a great artist. Um, I love this because this is like uh, Wally West. So we've got a guest appearance from the Teen Titans, my favorite here. Um, the art is pretty solid. I thought this was an interesting story. You know, um, Wally West has always been a great character. And so it was easy to, you know, embrace him as this was a fun Infinity Inc. and Outsiders crossover. I remember there was so much great stuff in the 80s. It was such a great time. I love this version of The Flash. This was very solid. Um, you know, this is kind of introducing like a lot of elements that made the character a little more realistic or a little more like, uh, I don't know, believable. Like he had, you know, a super fast metabolism and um, ate, had to eat a lot of food and, you know, got like, tired and stuff <laughs> and if the things you would imagine that would go along with having like a super fast metabolism um it's funny because i've been doing a couple of videos and uh jackson guice has popped up um in my swords of the swashbucklers video which is his like sword and sorcery book with bill mantlo and um you know talking with people and you just realize he's kind of one of those classic comic book artists that you really take advantage i mean he's or take for granted rather he's super solid he just says uh he also did x factor is something that i left out the beginnings of x factor when um you know gene gray was first resurrected back in the day and i know it's hard to keep up with so many different versions and iterations but you know what i mean but anyway i just like his because he definitely has that classic old school kind of solid superhero art where the characters look great and heroic but then you've also got really solid storytelling and he has a lot of nice detail to his work and props to Larry Malstead who's like a really great inker who I seem to recall inking Steve Lytle on um uh Doom Patrol perhaps but anyway I remember when this came out and just like really loving it, you know, like Flash is a character, Flash is one of those characters that I've always loved because I really love the Silver Age uh, superheroes, but they were a little bit before my time, so I didn't follow their books so much, but I've definitely always loved like their designs and everything. Um, so when Wally West, who I had already loved in the Teen Titans took over as the mantle of Flash, I was completely on board with that and very happy that that happened. John Byrne Batman annual cover there from 1987. Very cool. But this Flash was a lot of fun. Spoilers. They have him like uh, win the lottery here in the end, which I always thought was cool. Um, I feel like uh, Mike Barron like kind of wrote those great like sort of uh, almost slice of life sort of uh, making the characters sort of believable and relatable, you know, because we've all, all won the lottery. Just kidding. Very cool splash of Vandal Savage there. This was fun. I mean, I love The Flash. He's a great character. Wally West is The Flash is fine. Barry Allen is The Flash is fine. Whatever. This is The Flash from 1987 uh, by Mike Barron, Jackson Guice, and Larry Malstead. 
check it out, dust it off if you haven't read it. I recommend it. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. Hit like, share my content, and I'll bring you some more later. All right, thanks guys.